the reigning European 200 and 400 champion. Finished fourth in this 100 metres two years ago in Swansea. And Javier Porras of Spain. It being T11, they all mandatorily have guides. Timothy Adolf, who has won bronze in the last two World Championships. Three medals in Swansea two years ago, two golds, and then a silver in the relay based in Paris, the Paris Université Club, his guy being Gautier Simone, alongside in lane seven for Spain, Xavier Porras. Bronze in the long jump, very successful in the jumping competitions, the former world champion in the triple jump back in 2006. Subsequently won a bronze in uh, Beijing in 2008. He's never won an individual major championship medal, but has won a couple of bronzes in the relays. And Pablo uh, Quintero Lopez, by the way, in lane three for Spain. Six in both the long jump and the 100 meters in Swansea two years ago. Ivan Martinez de Nueza is his guide, so it's Quintero Lopez in three for Spain. Timothy Adolfo for France in five. Xavier Porras for Spain in lane seven. Only the winner guaranteed a spot in the final. And the next two fastest losers across both semis. Martin Pareko Maz in a very strong position as a result of being so close to Andre Poptev of Russia in the opening semi final. Toro Lopez three, Dol five, Porras in lane seven. <laughs> Away first time, very good start in three by Cantero Lopez with his guide Martinez Lunesa. But here comes Timothy Adolf, the European record holder, and he's gliding through. It's a good victory, 11.63. He takes it, Quintero second, Porras in third, was moving up towards the end, but 11.63. It's around quarter of a second outside of his European record. And the man who won two gold medals two years ago in Swansea in the last Europeans, looking very, very comfortable there. That's been rounded down to 11.62 in the end. And when he came through around the 40 meter mark, it wasn't really in any doubt. Gautier Simonea's guide and Adolf looking really comfortable in the end. Really good run there from Adolf. He's in the center of your picture there. World Championship bronze medalist in Leon and Doha over the 400 meters. So he's got great strength speed as well as the raw acceleration required for the 100 meters. Good work from his guide Gautier Simone as well. The European champion over 200 meters and 400 meters. And he's looking really good here over the 100 when you bear in mind He's only a few tenths of a second outside his own European record set last year. I think he was good value for that 11.62, and there's more to come from the Frenchman come the big final. Two impressive victories in the semi-finals, well under 12 seconds. Adolf winning 11.62, Quintero Lopez 12.28, Xavier Porres 12.30. It was very tight in the end of the race for second place.